Welcome back, everyone. So, we made it to Moon Base last time. Oh, there you are. Protecting the Northern Gate in the dead of night. The fame spreads like a black shadow. Protecting the Western Gate, the descendant of giants, dressed in blue, seeks out the hearts of comrades, steadily growing mas masterful. He is the final fortress of people's hope. In great turn, turns his blade upon the gods. Okay. Uh, I think you're the only one in this hallway, right? Yes. Okay. Out we go. That's not the way I want to go. I want to come this way. Oh, hi. Talk to me. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh my good lord, I do not have the money. Fragile metal plate. Okay. Uh. Other items. I think I've already got one of everything in here. Yep. Okay. I don't have enough to sell this. Shoot. Okay. So this is where we were heading. Uh, what's in here? Shopping center. Hello? Uh... Buy those. Okay. Uh, I've traveled a million hells to reach this place. No ice shit exists in the entire universe that I cannot swim with my board. No problem. The hero of the water shall protect us all. Okay. I can't get to you. Oh, now I can. Uh. Okay. You. Spells used to be free, but they've gone up in price a bit lately. Okay, you have the exact same stuff. Alright. So, nothing in here. I guard here, no bad guys get through. Okay. Can't remember if this is the way I need to go. I think it might be. Oh, well. That's no good. What's over here then? Probably absolutely nothing. Uh... Oh, whoops. Inside building. Oh, chest. Mine safe. Uh, 
Uh, can't get over there, so let's come up here. There's a chest. Oh, uh, yep. Okay. Oh. I saw him. And just went, yeah, no, let's just head straight for him. Alright, can you leave it? Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Intruders detected within facility. Well, yeah, it makes sense. You don't think they're talking about us, do you? I don't think so. I don't think so. I didn't mean to say that. Okay. What is that? Uh, that. I proclaim the will of the enforcers. You are a plague to be destroyed. Yeah, that, that's not something good. Is that one of the executioners? That's no god. Good point, Nell. Why are you doing this? The enforcers shall purify this defiled galaxy. The proclaimers shall purge the defilement. Okay. Prepare to die, irregularities. Um... Not if we have anything to say about it. Looks like we got a tough fight ahead of us. Let's give it our best shot! Wait. Oh, ow! Didn't go well. Oh, that's not what I want. If you would do something instead of just bouncing around. I must thank you. I don't have any MP. That that's enough. Good boy. Hold on. I don't know who it's chasing. Okay. To. Uh, actually, what we're going to do. Okay. Let's keep everybody alive for a minute. 
You back to life? Oh, they killed it. Before I got a chance to actually heal it. We got, we got it. It, whatever. That was one tough opponent. That it was. That actually was a pretty tough opponent. Alright. I proclaim the will of the enforcers. Yeah, well, um. Death and annihilation. Oh, I don't think so. Yes! Hi, Pepita! Uh, you need to listen to people. Oh, dear. Yeah, Maria got it. It's no laughing matter attacking so suddenly like that. You're reckless beyond all reason. Oh, well. Funny to hear you say that. So, what do we do? How am I supposed to know? Yeah, well. Sophia's got a point, and we can't really. She got here alone, so she should be able to get back too. Maria, that's her. That may be so, but. Well, what should we do? Turn her away? No. All right, just behave yourself. Oh, uh, well. It's a little late for that, don't you think? I mean, you've already come this far. Yeah. And I'd feel bad if I made you go back by yourself. So I figure at least while we're here, it'd be safer if we took you along with us. Well, that's reasonable logic. Well, that makes sense, I guess. <laughs> Jeez. All right. Woo! Cheers, everybody. All right. Remember, it's only until we leave Moonbase. Okay, well... Just try and stay out of trouble, okay? No problem. You can count on me! Sophia, you've already gotten yourself in trouble. Really? Oh, right! Let's go! 
That's not an answer to Sophia's last question there. Okay. So... Uh, this is the point where... I don't remember what I'm doing. How do I get this chest? Oh, we're in a research facility. Oh, chest. Hey, money! Woohoo! Bigger chest! And replace those perfect berries that I had. Wait, was it perfect berries I used? Or ripe berries? I think it was ripe berries I used, right? You stay there. I don't want to deal with you. Oh. Okay. Back the other way, please. Thank you. Oh, money! You, you stay right there. Uh. Where am I? I don't think I'm... Oh, laser weapon. Ah. Ah. Okay. Uh. What is it? Ghostface weapon. Oh. Okay. Hold on. We're gonna look at who's... Oh, where is... 328. Oh. Oh. Well, uh, your attack's pretty low, isn't it? Okay, well... Oh, wow. That's going to, uh... Skyrocket your attack, so yeah, you can have that. Hold on. Isn't there. Did I have a tip on you? No. I'll have that for now because that. I see that. I also see that chest. I don't want to go after that again. Okay. I have a feeling I'm getting further and further away from where I'm supposed to be going. Yeah. 
Y... Owie. Okay. I didn't even have to go that way. That annoys me. Okay. This is broken right now. Okay, I really don't know where I'm going. Oh, that doesn't look good. That's broken. Yep, leave me alone. Carbonite armor. Okay. There. Woohoo! I'm just trying to see if I can get the items here. NC program disk. Okay. There's a save point over there. So. Okay. Oh. Okay. Huh. Weird that they put that little jet in. Okay. Steam pumps here. I think tuna salad right here. Yeah. Alright. We are going to save for this file just so if something happens, I at least come back to this spot. This must be the uh, specific lab that we were searching for. There's a cutscene. No good. There's nothing here out of the ordinary. Oh. Uh... Computer, we'd like to browse the database for information on weapons using symbological genetics. Okay. Is that going to work? No matching data found. Wow, it's convenient. All these computers have the same voice. Damn. Does the data even exist? Uncle Robert wouldn't lie. The data must be in here somewhere. He wouldn't lie. He would just hide stuff from us. She's right. Don't give up yet. I know. I know. It's gonna be somewhere's kind of crazy. Computer, scan my genetic profile and search the database for any matching data. That makes sense. Scanning. Searching. Okay. 
One result found. Oh, well, there we go. Bingo. Display. Okay. Oh, that doesn't look. The coming crisis for humanity. This doesn't sound good. Let's check it out. Well, yeah, we kind of have yeah. to. Hello. Oh, hello. My dad and Uncle Robert. They're yeah. pretty young, but I think you're right. Well, we already know that that's uh, almost. I literally just got myself tongue tied. Jeez. Mom. And Maria's mother. I think the last one is, uh... That woman on the end? Yeah. Yes. That's her. And then, I think it's Fate's mom is in the middle there, right? Okay, are, are, is there any audio? This project was oh. initiated as a result of the exploration of the planet Styx in galactic year 752. Okay. Styx is an unusual planet on which explorers found the Time Gate, a portal that seems to be a sort of time machine. Okay, so this is all new to me. A full-scale study but... of Styx and the Time Gate was undertaken in 752. Okay, you couldn't have just said in the same year? The time gate is sentient. Wait, what? <laughs> that was about all we knew about it, based on our research up to that point. No one yet knew who had created the time gate, or for what purpose. It's sentient? Oh boy, However, that can't be good. All became clear after the study conducted in galactic year 752. Okay, do you just want to say 752? Never heard about this before. Something this big should have been major news. Which means they covered it up for a reason. After an investigation extending over several weeks, we have discovered that the time gate responds to symbological data. Okay. And it was recently discovered that when certain special symbological data are sent into the time gate, it is possible to obtain recorded data from the time gate itself. What's the point of having all four of them in the shot if he's going to be the only one talking? However, included in these data was information more horrifying than we could have imagined. This would be where they learned about the uh, enforcers, right? We learned of the existence of 4D beings. 4D beings? A 4D being? Yeah, that's an interesting... Four dimensional entities possessing technology Did far you more advanced answer than our our question? Own including the ability to travel through time. Ooh, well... Furthermore, as we continued our research, we found out that these beings may actually have created our universe. Oh, well... C created Yeah, well... Sounds like a fairy tale to me. Honestly, though... Shh, quiet. The symbological technology that we use today originated with these beings. Okay. The time gate on the planet Styx was also created by using their advanced symbological technology. Okay. Kind of explains why it's a lot. Well, we what did we thought that the time gate was a portal for traveling through time, but it appears we were wrong. Oh, how were you wrong? The time gate is in fact a door to 4D space. Oh, okay. Time travel was a phenomenon that occurred as a result of the protective measures taken to prevent us from detecting the existence of 4D space. Okay. The 4D universe allows free movement through time, and the time gate tapped into that potential. Oh. This was a most exciting discovery. Your definition of exciting and mine are kind of different. Not only were we able to unravel the mystery of the time gate, we were also able to confirm the existence of a new species. Okay, yeah, but um, that species is but trying to kill us now. Something completely unexpected happened. The time gate spoke a warning. Okay. 
resign thyself. What are we resigning ourselves for? Doctor, the time gate. What in the world? Science and the eternal sphere has advanced too far. This cannot be left unchecked. Uh oh. Eternal sphere? That doesn't sound good. The eternal sphere is the universe as known to your kind. Okay. Time gate, tell us what you mean. Our science has advanced too far? Symbological genetics is the science of the creator, as is the symbology on which it is based. It is a forbidden art. Oh, well, uh... Your kind has foolishly trespassed into a forbidden domain. How are we supposed to know it was a forbidden domain? There is a danger that this forbidden technology will be turned against the creator. Thus, the time is near when he shall unleash the wrath of his enforcers upon you all. Well, um... Thank you for at least for giving us a heads up. We're terrified by the Time Gate's warning. Uh, I can't say I blame you. <laughs> the Creator was going to destroy his creations. Yeah. It appeared that the Armageddon prophesied by numerous religions was going to come true. Probably not the way we they asked thought, whether we but we could escape annihilation by abandoning symbological genetics. Uh oh. But the Time Gate's reply completely crushed all our hopes. No. It is too late. Even should you abandon your work, another will come to take it up again. Such is the way of your kind. Can't argue with that. You are contaminated beyond salvation. Uh oh. Your annihilation is inevitable. This is not a warning. This is a sentence. Oh. Resign thyself. Well, I mean, in a way. Resign thyself. It is a warning. Resign thyself. Yes, okay, we get it. Resign ourselves. We got it. We return to Moon Base. Stunned. Yep, that would be stunning. This entity, beyond our understanding, had proclaimed our doom. At first. We considered reporting this to the top levels of the Federation government. But it was too outrageous. Yeah. We knew that no one would believe us. Kind of fair. Our choice was either to reconcile ourselves to the Creator's wish for our destruction, or to fight to the bitter end. We chose the path of resistance. Okay. We would not accept our death sentence. If we are to die, we'll die fighting. Yeah, you kind of did. Be that as it may, our enemy was the creator of our universe. Okay. How could we face an enemy who possessed absolute power? Uh, to fight, yeah. we needed a tremendous power of our own. Okay. We decided to use symbological genetics in an attempt to create a weapon. A human with powers that could defeat the Creator. Okay, so... This was our project. That's what led to... Okay. Why... Why am I not moving forward? There, okay. <laughs> Two children were selected to be the subjects of our experiments. Yeah. Nope. Oh. Okay. I am sure there is no way we could ever apologize enough to these children. No way we could ever earn their forgiveness. People may label us as monsters. Yeah, well... I can kind of see both sides of this now. Okay, like, can I move forward, please? Why am I, like, stuck? Hello? Oh, 
Okay. I'm not sure why it's not doing anything. All right. I'm going to call it here. I'll see if I can figure out what's going on with this cutscene. And I'll pick up from here. Alright guys, I'll see you later. Bye.